Hi guys, Ralu here. So I want to share with you today these two beautiful fragrances. I combined them today and um, it just reminded me how much I love them and specifically this one. Uh, I wanted to do a mini review of them because I think that this one right here would be a great one um, with the upcoming summer. Like if you were a bride, it would be a really nice one. So let me start with this one. This is called Pure Grace Nude Rose. And um, yeah, I am in a car, guys. My husband is fishing. <laughs> um, never miss an opportunity to film in nature. Uh, so this one is very beautiful. I wear this if it was my wedding day because it's such a beautiful, interesting rose to me. This has notes of um, rose, of course, but it also has something green in the beginning, in the opening, but it's not super sharp. And it also has um, neroli and, I believe, jasmine, musk, and woods, woodiness as a base. Um, it's so well blended, I think. It truly, all I can picture is a nude bouquet of roses. Uh, smelling like this is um, I think a softer than the uh, the other one that I have uh, just because it has that I think that neroli gives it a little bit of a maybe I wouldn't say tropical but maybe along the line the vibes of that uh, the rose with the neroli definitely gives it a very unique and interesting twist. It's a really nice fragrance. I got this at TJ Maxx for like $12. And if you like roses and if you like fragrances like Chloe, uh, then um, yeah, I think you would like this. Actually, speaking of Chloe, this particular one reminds me a lot of Chloe roses, which I have. Um, but this one has lychee in the opening and it is truly amazing. This one's called Ballet Rose. Um, it is, uh, um, it has a slightly fruity air when you first spray this one, comparing to this one has a more green vibe when you first spray it. Um, but they're both beautiful. And, uh, this one, so this one has lychee and this one has roses and peony. And I think they both have woody and musk dry down. Uh, this is like, if you like, uh, nice, clean, um, slightly fruity because of the lychee. Um, when you first apply it, it's, just so beautiful uh, and uh, I love them both. I think uh, at some point I might get the full size of the both of them. Um, so yeah, very, very beautiful rose fragrances. If you like a fruitier, uh, fresher kind of rose, then clean, then try this one. If you like something more like um, with neroli and a little bit of a greener vibe, then maybe try the nude rose. But this has like a neroli, like I said, and uh, it has a softer vibe, so even though it has that green note in the beginning. Both beautiful fragrances. Let me know in the comments if you have ever tried these. Uh, and if you did, what do you think? I'm actually thinking about getting one that is called um, Philosophy Cream, Cashmere Cream or something. I've heard that is really good. And uh, yeah, but if you like roses, though, give these ones a shot. I bought both of them at TJ Maxx for very little. Uh, best way to try a fragrance, see if you like it, and then you get the full size. Um, like, these are perfect little bottles for travel and everything, too. So yeah, and that's it. It's a beautiful day today. We're in nature. Like I said, my husband is fishing. He caught two big ones so far. <laughs> uh and uh thanks so much for watching guys don't forget to subscribe i appreciate your thumbs up and uh, i'll see you in the next video now take care bye